Scandal at the FDIC FDIC Chair Martin Grunberg, known for his fiery temper, stands accused of fostering a toxic workplace culture. The drama unfolds with a WSJ investigation, revealing harassment and discrimination allegations left unpunished under Grunberg's watch. In a jaw-dropping revelation, it's discovered that in 2019, the FDIC's number two legal official left a ranting, cursing voicemail for an employee, leading to a $100,000 settlement. But hold your horses, the plot thickens. Despite this, Gruenberg promoted this official to become the agency's general counsel. Gruenberg's leadership is now under intense scrutiny, with Congress grilling him on the FDIC's longtime toxic atmosphere. Allegations include sexism, harassment, and racial discrimination, with few consequences for those accused of misconduct. Adding fuel to the fire, Grunberg himself has been labeled a bully with an explosive temper, berating and cross-examining staffers. An external investigation in 2008 delved into an incident where Grunberg allegedly lost his temper with a senior female official. In a shocking twist, Gruenberg denied being subject to investigations for inappropriate workplace conduct in a House hearing, only to recant his testimony later. This admission came after the WSJ contacted the FDIC for comment, revealing a 2008 inquiry into his behavior. The FDIC's leadership woes don't end there. Under Gruenberg's leadership, the agency's director of its Office of Minority and Women Inclusion was accused of discrimination including making a controversial comment about slavery. Despite these allegations, the director was merely reassigned, not demoted. Employee Stephanie Gilliard, who left the agency in 2018, shared her experience of discrimination and a hostile work environment, leading to a $250,000 settlement. But when she reached out to Grunberg for help, she was met with silence. This sensational story paints a picture of a bank regulator in turmoil with Grunberg at the center of a whirlwind of controversy and allegations. As this scandalous tale unfolds, one can't help but wonder what's next for Grunberg and the FDIC. Stay tuned for more on this sensational saga.